Ashes, craftbeer.com, and with me as always is Nubs. What's going on? And the Ashtray. I am the Ashtray. Damn, God. It's a noisy Ashtray. Uh, the beer we're going to be reviewing this week is uh, Moraline uh, Brewing Company, and the name of the beer is Barbarossa. It's a double dark lager. It's actually much like the beer that we reviewed last week. Uh, it's a Munich Dunkel Lager is what they call it. So it's probably going to be a very similar taste. Uh, you know, the last beer that we uh, reviewed was the uh, Negro Modelo, and it was a pretty decent brew. Uh, $7.99 a six-pack. This was actually also $7.99 a six-pack, so uh, it might be a good comparison to kind of see the two different Munich Dunkel Lagers together to see which one compares better uh, with taste because they're both the same price. So. Well, last week I actually tried that one, and I was saying I thought that was uh, hitting the line for Holy Grail. So... Uh, yeah. I'm guessing with this one being as close as it sounds like it's going to be, this has a good shot of actually being Holy Grail. Well, I guess we'll find out. Yeah. There's a whole uh, way to find out. There's not really a lot of information about this one. Uh, we could read off a little silly description they got in the back for you a little bit here after we do the pour, but real quick, it's 5% ABV, uh, the IBUs is 18, and it's actually the Christian Morlon. Uh, brewing company, which is happens to be in Cincinnati, Ohio, which is where uh, we're at. So I thought that was kind of interesting. I'd like to try out some of their other brews since it's a local brewery. I'd like to support those if I can. I do like so, the idea that it's double dark too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That should make it a, a double dark really, lager. Really good brew. Yep. Let me just zoom it in here. Ah! Oh! Who was that? Put that scene on scanners. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what kind of aroma we're uh, getting from this, too. Yeah, while you guys are sniffing it, I'll kind of show the bottle here. This is what it looks like. Double mm -hmm. dark. Oh, smells good, man. It smells and, really uh, good. This is the box. It's got like a malt aroma from it. Barbarossa double dark lager. A malty type. Seven ninety nine uh, six type. Does it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Yep, you're right. Get that too. Let me do the pour real quick because I'm sure everyone's tired of looking at my head. Ain't that sexy. Uh, 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 pouring it out, it's uh, kind of got a pretty frothy uh, head to it actually. And uh, really light. It's reddish. brown color. Yeah, kind of like almost reddish. Yeah, when, when, it, when it hits the glass, it actually becomes a very uh, dark brown reddish color. It's actually a lot of head there on mine. Uh, definitely about a two finger head. I'm going to go ahead and zoom out since everyone's tired of looking at my nose hairs. But uh, hmm. smells good. Hopefully it tastes good. Yeah. Boys ready for this endeavor? Yeah, I'm, th I'm pretty thirsty. Let's go. Let's Cheers. Go. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, this is very that tasty. That is awesome. Very tasty. This is actually a lot better than the Negro Modelo. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. would say almost double better. I love oh so. gosh! Yeah, I mean, it's. I'm glad I didn't totally go with the Holy Grail on that oh, rating yeah. because this is, uh, in my opinion, this hit the Holy Grail. Yeah, right this here. is really good. This is excellent. Oh, it's good. Dark. Yeah, dark. <coughs> It's, it's a, it's, <clears throat> it's thicker, it's not as thin as some of the other beers that we've reviewed recently, so it's got a little bit of syrup to it, which is a good thing, I think. Um, really enjoyable. Yeah, it's it's not very strong ABV, it's only 5%, but that's not bad, it's, it's really tasty. Uh, try, I'm trying to get what I, you know, a description of the taste. I'm getting, like, this, this is one of the beers that you, you want to drink. Casually, s slowly, and, and savor the flavor. I think you could enjoy this with a nice cigar. Nice, oh, yeah. dark cigar. Yeah. This nice. is a if dark cigar. If you're a cigar smoker, then yeah, that, this would be a very, very good uh, compliment. Like to a real good uh, dark, dark cigar. Dark Maduro. 
Go with a Maduro. Uh, yeah, definitely like a, a Maduro or double Maduro, and then like something like this where it's double dark. That's if you like the full body type stuff. But yeah, mm. this is this is really good. You know what's interesting is uh, last week uh, the Munich Dunkel Lager, which was the uh, Neger Modella, I said reminded me a lot of a Warsteiner Dunkel. This actually, to me, doesn't taste like Warsteiner Dunkel. Mm -mm. It tastes different. It, it's a whole different taste, even though it might be in that Munich. Dunkel category. To me, it actually has a malty taste to it, but it almost has a little bit of like a fruity taste to it. Like a, I don't know, like a fig type. I guess that's why they're calling it uh, double dark lager. Yeah, it's, it's definitely really good. Mm -hmm. Really enjoyable no matter what the occasion, you know. But something to, something to definitely drink when you're relaxing, you know. If you're just trying to get something to to start getting hammered with, I mean, sure, this this would do it, but your percentage ratings and things, it's not <laughs> ideal. This is more one for kicking back, relaxing, and just mm -hmm. enjoying enjoying the time to relax and have a nice uh, beverage. So. Oh, yeah. I think this is, uh, I'm going to go with Holy Grail. What are you guys thinking? I think Holy Grail, too. I think this might be the first Holy Grail. Yep. Is that three Holy Grails, then? I think we got it. All right. All right. Man. We got it. Sweet. First Holy Grail of this is... Uh, the craft beer uh, stamp of approval on this one. Uh, Moraline uh, Brewing Company, Barbarossa, Double Dark Lager. Uh, it's, it's called it Smooth Bavarian Style Double Dark Lager or Munich Dunkel. Really good beer, 5% ABV, 18 IBU. Um, malty, kind of a, a fruity taste to it. Reddish color. Yeah, reddish brown color. Uh, you know, kind of a a thicker syrupy than the more of a thin. Decent head on it. Decent head, really good beer. That's what she said. Hey yo. <laughs> hey yo. <laughs> Are we gonna do that every time? <laughs> <laughs> but you know that's about it. You know, uh, take our opinion for what it is and uh, just drink try it, it yourself. Try it yourself. You know, just uh, make maybe challenge us if you want. Yep. Try it yourself and and go out and buy this. You know, it's not definitely not a loss in any of our opinion. It's money well spent. Buy this. And, you know, maybe just pour yourself a glass and sit down and have have time to just watch our review and maybe do a comparison and see if, you know, hey, maybe these guys do kind of know what they're talking about and have somewhat of the same taste variety that, that I like, you know. just mm -hmm. This is, we're calling this a holy grail, so, uh, you know, give it a try. I wouldn't say uh, we know what we're talking about, but <laughs> <laughs> we know what tastes good. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> We still have lots to learn on this. Yeah, I actually want to try out this uh, brewing company too. They're a Cincinnati brewing company. I'm kind of excited to see what else they got. And uh, maybe we'll check it out. Maybe we'll even be in contact with them to see if we can get some samples or something. Samples are always good. And if anyone out there, you know, as always, would like yeah. to give us samples, that's excellent. If you'd like to see us review a beer, uh, just send us something at uh, crapbeer2 at gmail.com. Or uh, dial us at 513-253-0221, which is our uh, crap beer and crap cigar hotline. And I've got an excellent idea for you out there, too. Since beer is usually uh, going to cost you more in shipping, if you'd like, you could uh, send us a, a, a gift card. <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> and we could oh, use, this, is a, this is a great <laughs> idea, and we could use this gift card. We just lost all of our listeners right there. <laughs> well, it's, it's I practical. apologize for that comment. All right. Folks. Well, I'll video just, gold over here. Video <laughs> gold. <laughs> just an idea I throw out there because that way, if you want us to try a special blend, you don't have to pay for the shipping on the six pack. You can just send us a gift card, and we can go buy the six pack, and then we'll review the beer. I think it's I think it's practical, but maybe I'm just trying to scam someone. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> but anyway, with that, we're gonna leave you. This is Long Ashes. Ashtray nubs, and we're going to continue to search for more Holy Grails of Ales. That's right. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.